Welcome to Rick Snyder's Washington on YouTube, where you get the whole story. So please like, share, subscribe, comment, even hit the thanks button. And don't forget, Monday night, 8 to 9 Eastern, I'll have a live chat on YouTube. Come with your questions. We'll talk about Washington Commanders training camp. Also, the Commanders signed running back Derek Gore uh, today. He played limited in Kansas City with Eric Bieniemy. So he rounds out the roster at 90 guys. We'll see what he can do. All right, the big news today was, of course, uh, the Washington Post did the story. It said Jamin Davis was in court to try and uh, settle up on his speeding ticket. Not just any speeding ticket. Turns out that uh, March of 2022, he was caught doing 114 and a 45. That's about 69 miles an hour over. And over 20 miles an hour, the cops can actually lock you up for reckless driving. They can handcuff you right to the car there. So be careful when you're in Virginia and any other state like this. All right, so basically uh, he was convicted of it, was given 30 days, a suspended uh, driver's license and a fine, but he appealed it. And they had a deal going forward with the prosecution for eight days max. Usually means you're going to serve half. But the judge rejected it. So Thursday that goes this. We'll see what happens. All right, but it reminds me of uh, one other case with the Washington Redskins back in the day. <clears throat> Before the 97 camp, Terry Allen was caught doing 133. In Monroe, Georgia, also convicted of a DUI, reckless driving, ran from the cops. And um, it took a year, but he finally served five of ten days that he was sentenced to there in an unconditioned place in July. Ooh, in Georgia, woo. And uh, <coughs> also, let's not forget Jason Wirth of the Washington Nationals in 2015 was caught doing 105 plus on the Beltway uh, the year before in a 55. He did five days in prison. Uh, for reckless driving and had his license suspended. So, no more smoking the bandit out there, boys. I'm Rick Snyder. Thanks for coming. I'll see you 8 to 9 tonight.